I just came out to relax, see if there's any striped bass out, and get a fish after work. <laughs> um, had a bit of work, some things to do today. Did something yesterday, but I just kind of had to go out and see if the fish are biting. So we'll see. It started with a surf candy, and that kind of it spin sparse. It's how the fishing is, but I did get a look on that and fish turn. So now I'm going to try. I didn't. It was riding a little too high in the water. So I'm going to go with a half hat. This is one of my favorite flies. You can use a clouser minnow. It's a medium eyes, I believe. And uh, that looks like a 2010 hook. All right. All right. He's going deep. That's a beauty. Let's kind of jot it out here. Wow. Oh, no. Let's to play him out. See, see what he's about. Wow, that's wild. Full moon. Got that ventilators. Oh, wow. One thing you don't want them run, running under the pier. <gasps> Grab the half and half. It's a nice fish. There he is. See what he's all about. Wow, oh, he's a good fish. I haven't done this in a while. So, let's see if we get him up. That is just fun on the fly. Definitely, I wouldn't call this any kind of a fast bite at all. He looks like a keeper, too. Wow, he just inhaled that fly. On his way, he's got a 28. He's pretty close. I wouldn't keep him though. Okay. That is cool. Let's get you on your way, bud. I'm gonna flip you. Very cool. Now that's the fly I'm using. That is a half and half uh, medium dumbbell eyes. It's about a size one or one oh or two oh will do. And uh one of my favorite flies, you'll catch anything, bluefish, fluke, striped bass, anything with these here. Clouds as well, just as well. But doing fly fishing for pier bass tonight, and just a nice relaxing, relaxing, relaxing fish. Fly fishing for pier bass, really enjoyable way to fish. And one thing I like to do is, you don't even have to cast. I'll just kind of roll my line in the water, let it sink, do its drop, and then I just kind of walk it, walk it through the current. You give it slack, that fly drops, drift it down, give it a few twitches back, let it drop, just like that. I don't know, the fish, they're not showing themselves, so I'm letting that fly, seeing if it gets their attention. I'm going to fly down deep with some line. Let the current do what it wants with that fly. The more natural that fly looks, I think the better your chances are. Kind of just work it 
after a current. Who knows what it's doing? Kind of fast twitches, pulled just gets attention. Alright, that one did. That is a is that a blue? That might be a bluefish. That's a bonus. I don't want him to eat my fly. Got dinner. Oh, we're gonna let him go. That's a blue. That's a bonus. We're doing some pure fly. <laughs> that is a bluefish. Fly back. Oh, I heard that. Oh. That's a nice blue. So cool. Wow. He's gonna eat my fly. That's the fly that's working. Sometimes we can get him. Opens his mouth, doesn't inhale our fly. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I'm gonna let you go, buddy. Oh, he's ate someone's line. Alright, let's get this beautiful bluefish back in the water. Oh. <laughs> it's so like potato chips. Um, I came looking for one but uh, <laughs> uh just like potato chips you just can't can't have one but one fish so uh we're going so these are probably you know you come with these three flies are really right for this um and other ones your surf candies your half half browsers about size 10201 but i also do like to carry around uh, the small clousers, or you can use great, that's crazy, Charlie, or something like that. Really great flies for striped bass, bluefish for this, uh, uh, anywhere. So, I'll throw the surf candy a little. That was cool. So, I was looking to get a striped bass. We got a bluefish, which is all, you know, this is great. Um, just relaxing, enjoying the night, doing some relaxing. Here, fly fishing, I haven't done this in ages, but. I used to do this a lot, so. Wow. Ooh. Wow. Make sure, make sure I got a good, get the hook on him. Not want them to go under, that is for sure. That's my line. Okay, we don't want that either. Now oh, he's digging hard, he's really digging, digging deep and deep and hard. Dark here. It's okay. Oh, I feel his tail slapping the line. Got some good leader on there. It's 30 pound leader. He feels like a nice fish. He's about 
And the rod I'm using, this is a, this is a nine weight. This rod is given to me by my friend Ron. And thank you, Ron. I have bluefish with this. Great rod for, wow, he's yeah, a nice fish. He's a nice one. Let's see what he's about. He's just perfect on the size. Straight bass. The wind's picking up now. Let's go. See what he is about. See what he is about. Wow. See if we even get him up. That's a nice fish. That's a nice one. That's a beauty. Okay, bring him up slow, easy, easy. Go! We got him. That's a keeper. He just grabbed that shark candy. Nice pure fish, that's for sure. Came out looking for a, uh, a fish tonight and just get out and what fish is all about, get out and relax. And uh, kind of got into it. The fishing was great. And, uh, you know, like potato chips, just can't, I don't know, just, just can't have one, so got to feed bass striped bass and uh, bluefish and actually I was bit off by a bigger bluefish so yeah really good fun quick fishing fly fishing for striped bass pure fly fishing for striped bass thanks for watching